Okay, hello YouTube. Um, I messed up the first video because uh, I found out if I hit F12 in uh, Chrome, like setting stuff comes up for the web page, so I had to redo it. And if this banner is somewhat annoying, um, I'm sorry about that. That's the only way I could really do it. So I was making a video about uh, tr this new game I found on white.com called Track Racing Online Pursuit. So I'll click on it and I'll show it to you guys. I have also Twitter and YouTube up there, as you can tell. I'm not worried about that right now. Okay, so now it's all showing up. Um, so they have, they have three game modes: Street Race, Deathmatch, and Survival. Um, we'll try them in order. So before I get started, um, let's get this up to maybe five likes. But anyway, let forget about that. Uh -huh. I just want people to like my videos, I don't know. If I don't get the five likes, it's fine. I just want a few likes. If you can do five likes, that would be very appreciated to get at least some likes started. Um, because I know a lot of other people say, let's get a video up to certain likes. So, um, let's do Street Race. So, okay, so Street Race, basically the objective is to avoid other players and the, the cop people, which are also other players. So... Basically, everyone's trying to get you, and you're on your own, so unless you're a cop, you can't kill each other. Only, uh, I guess what you could call the racers are can kill each other, which I'm about to die, which I just died. So, basically, the objective of this game, of this game mode, is, well, of every game mode in this uh, game, is to rack up the most points and win each uh, and win so yeah so as you can see I took no damage from it because fellow cops cannot kill each other which is actually good in a way that makes sense I mean the racers also make sense because you're kind of on your own I guess I don't know um, in the beginning it's crazy because everyone's trying to kill you and yeah so basically, these are real people playing. As you didn't, if you didn't figure out, you can chat with other people. You can do everything with other people. So yeah, I mean it's it's really fun. I did not do good that time because I joined kind of late. But as you see, everyone starts as a racer. You can never start as a cop unless you tap R enough times, which you just die and you can become a cop right away if you really do want to. See, as you can see, like people just will kill you because they want to win and the, the more people you kill the more points you gain you get three points per kill I think or something which is a lot and you get one point per uh, checkpoint which only the racers can do which also makes sense so as a cop you're just pretty much trying to eliminate the other racers and uh, hopefully by doing that you win so yeah that's basically this one I'm not gonna do this anymore um, so let's go to the other ones if they're still here. Let's see. Hopefully it's working. Okay, good, it's working. So deathmatch is totally different. It's you're all racers. You cannot become a cop, and you're. It's basically team deathmatch and COD. The more kills you get, the more points you win, uh, do. Except it's more free for all team deathmatch than a uh, team deathmatch because there's only one team. So it's actually I would call this more free for all instead of team deathmatch because um, it's like I said you're more just on your own killing or trying to kill everybody getting the most points which is what you do in free for all except the only difference from COD's free for all is that it's only one winner not first, second, and third so that's a downside and stuff. Oh, I killed somebody. All right. So obviously, the more kills you get, the more points you get. You can also get rockets, which you use. You first of all, you use the sh what you use to shoot is a uh, right um, mouse, which uh, left mouse, which is unusual shooting games. I've really never played much except for like Gary's Mod and stuff like that. But I, I'm pretty sure clicking the mouse in any game will like shoot and using WASD or the arrow keys will make you move so basically it's 
simple controls like every game. So it's not that hard to master. Uh, the only it's hard to shoot because like you have if someone gets in your way, like if you back up, you can't see. Like look at this, you can't see, so you don't know if you're shooting anybody, and you have to be facing them because you can't you can't turn your the guns, which is kind of a downside. If you could turn the guns in other directions, that would be great. Right now I'm doing good. I have six points. I don't really know how the scoring system works now. Because I got two kills and I only have six points, so uh, whatever. It depends on the kill, I think. There's also health packs, which I think you can increase your life. Yeah, you can increase your life, I think, up to 300, which is a lot. So yeah, you can basically, basically just drive around, get as many as, uh, health packs as you can find, and uh, it'll increase your health. And you can also get more bullets, because um, bullets do go through fast. They are unlimited. Put it, that is a good thing. So anyway, let's get out of this. I don't want to make this video that long. Um, I'm just. This is just more of a like, kind of showing you this game. Oh, let's scroll down. I don't know what that is at the top. Damn. Uh, I think I'm gonna host survival. So I don't see it again. Wait, survival's all full. I wanna. Okay, so it's. Those, this, they're all full or something. Okay, so let's go survival, start. So basically you're escaping, as it says here, escape cops as long as possible. I think every game tells you what to do, or the objective. So I just wanted to show you this game and show you guys that it, this game is very fun and you should give it a try. Just don't put it aside like, oh, because anyone can play this game. I mean, if you have a computer, which most of you guys probably do, you can play this game. Just go to y8.com. I'll post everything in the description below when I upload the video. Um, so yeah, I, I'm either going to upload it today or tomorrow. I think I might do it tomorrow. I don't know. Alright, people just joined. So basically what you're doing is just going through the uh, these, escaping the cop as long Because there is a... Uh, what do you call it? A AI? No, not an AI. Um, a uh, CPU cop who f who will follow you, trying to kill you, at, which is how other players become cops in this game. So this is a this is a longer game game mode. With they're all fun. In my opinion, I like street race and uh, deathmatch the best. I haven't really given this much thought because I haven't played it as much, but this one's okay. It's more just driving around, getting... And more cops spawn, I think, as the time goes on to make it harder. So it just keeps getting harder and harder. This this one's pretty good, but compared to the other two, this one's probably the, my least favorite. Because it just kind of gets boring if... Uh, because the CPUs are kind of easy, and you have a lot of health and a lot of time. So anyway, let's... Let's leave this. I'm sorry if that game ends. I have three other games that I'm going to show you, just not today because it's eight minutes, which is actually pretty long. So I just mostly want to make this video because I've saw a lot of other games which you can play. I haven't tried most of them. I have tried a few games here. How I found out about this is uh, 2010 Penalty Shootouts which was a while ago. I think I was in 8th grade when uh, I found out about 2010 World Cup right here. World Cup 2010 Penalty Shootouts. That's a pretty fun game. You should try that as well. The last game was online, so I could play with you guys if you really wanted me to. Um, yeah. So, I'm gonna go. Um, hopefully you enjoyed this game, the gameplay of the game I just showed you, which is Track Racing Online Pursuit. Um, I will play it more with either some of my friends if I do get any to play it, or um, just by myself and showing you it more, or playing with you guys, my subscribers. If I, that's only if I get enough subscribers that want to either play or gain a lot of subscribers from this. But anyway, I'm going to go because it's going to tell me in five seconds that I'm over the recording. Okay, bye.